here we go for the next problem find the point on the x axis which is equidistance from 2 comma minus 5 and minus 2 comma 9 so it is given uh, two points and it says the point is on x axis if a point is on x axis anywhere we call it as an uh, x comma 0 right so anywhere means it here when 1 comma 0 or 2 comma 0 or 3 comma 0 or 4 comma it is on axis right so x comma 0 so the point on x axis is x comma 0 and another two point is given let me call it as a a 2 comma minus 5 and b minus 2 comma 9 and given condition it is a equidistance from the x axis so from the x axis 2 comma minus 5 distance will be equal to the distance between the x axis and the minus 2 comma 5 that means uh, let me call it as a point p p a will be equal to the p b so distance of p a will be equal to the p b that way that is what is given a equidistance so the PA will be that so to find the PA that you consider these two points so square root of x2 here is a 2 2 minus ax 2 minus x the whole square plus uh, minus 5 is a 0 so minus 5 the whole square is equal to uh, square root of PB now these two so here is x2 minus 2 minus x the whole square plus 9 minus 0 just a 9 square right so square root square root we can cancel by taking but the square root will become a square and square and square root will be cancelled right so now this we can expand using the identities right so 2 square is a 4 square and it will become a plus x square minus 2 uh, into 2 into x 2ab right plus 5 square is a 25 is equal to here the minus uh, will be like a minus 2 square will be the 4 and minus x square will be the x square and uh, uh, plus minus into minus will become 2 right so 2 into 2 to 2 into x plus 9 is a 81 so this is a 4 square not 4 right we already squared here 2 square is a 4 so just bring everything this side it will become a 4 plus x square uh, no x term will be take here numbers will be take that so that we will get an a uh, value of x minus 4x uh, plus 25 so let me number here bring that x square x square will become minus x square if you bring here 2 to the 4x plus 4x will become minus 4x is equal to 4 plus 81 so plus x square minus x square will be 0 that's 4 and 25 will take this side and minus 4x minus 4x is a minus 8x so minus 8x is equal to 4 plus 81 is a 85 and uh, this 4 it will take it will be minus 4 and 25 will be a minus 25 so minus 8x is equal to 85 minus 4 is 81 81 minus 25 56 right and uh, x is equal to 56 divided by minus 8 it will comes for 7 times so x is equal to negative 7 so point on the x axis is uh, we have found x is a negative 7 so here is equal to minus 7 comma 0 right so therefore point on x axis is minus 7 comma 0 that's why we consider x comma 0 minus 1 comma 0 so here we go for the next problem find the value of y for which distance between the point p 2 comma minus 3 and q 10 comma y is 10 units the distance is given we have to find the value of y so so distance is nothing distance between pq is is equal to 10 pq will be written as a square root of x2 minus x1 x2 is a 10 minus 2 is an 8 so 8 square plus y minus into minus 3 is plus 3 the whole square is equal to 10 if you take uh, square root of this side it will become a square and 8 square is a 64 plus this we can use an identities it will become a y square plus 3 square is a 9 plus 3 to the 6 6 y is equal to 100 right taking square this side it will become a 
so square root of this side it will become a square clear so now uh, we can obtain the 64 and 9 it will be in like in a something uh, quadratic form right y square plus 6 y 64 plus 9 73 is equal to 100 so y square plus 64 plus 73 if you bring 100 here it is a minus 100 is equal to 0 and if you subtract we will get a y square plus 6y 673 minus 100 is a minus 27 equal to 0 now it is a quadratic equation we can solve so the product is a minus 27 and the sum is a plus 6 the so 1 is multiple right so what we will get um, 9 3 is a 27 and if we subtract 9 and 3 is a 6 right 9 3 is a 27 if you subtract it you have to be a plus 6 so we will make a minus 3 here right so 9 into minus 3 is a minus 27 9 minus 3 is a plus 6 so you divided by the 1 right 1 only we have multiple that so 1 y it's a y right so y plus 9 into y minus 3 is equal to 0 so y plus 9 is equal means then y is equal to so consider y plus 9 equal to 0 then y is equal to minus 9 or y minus 3 equal to 0 then y is equal to 3 so the value of y either minus 9 or plus 3 the value of y is either minus 9 or plus 3 clear here we go for the next problem find the relationship between x and y such that the point x comma y is equidistant from the point 3 comma 6 and minus 3 comma 4 so it is uh, let me consider this point as p p x is a x comma y and the equidistance point is a 3 comma 6 and b minus 3 comma 4 so it is given a equidistance from this distance between these two points will be given a distance between these two points that is nothing but pa is equal to pb so pa is in a square root of 3 minus x square plus 6 minus y square is equal to pb is equal to minus 3 minus x square So plus 4 minus y the whole square and square and square it will be cancelling so 3 minus y the whole square we are using an identities so 3 minus x the whole square is a 9 3, 3 square is 9 plus x square is x square minus 3 to 6 6 into x is a 6 6 minus 6 x plus here the 6 square is a 36 uh, plus y square and uh, 3 uh, 2 6 are 12 uh, it's a minus minus 12 y is equal to the same here minus 3 minus x square will become a 3 square is a 9 plus x square plus 6 x plus here 4 square is a 16 plus y square minus 8 y right so x square and x square will be cancelled while bring this here it will be subtraction and y square and y square also will be a zero so let x and y term be here let me bring everything here we need only relationship right so 9 minus 6x plus 36 minus 12y if you bring here it is a minus 9 and a, a minus 6x minus 16 plus 8y is equal to 0 again okay, the plus 9 and minus 9 is 0 minus 6 and minus 6 is a minus 12x what about the y so x x u term return minus 12 plus 8 is a 4 and minus 4 right minus 4y and 36 plus 36 minus 16 is a plus 20 20 is equal to 0 clear okay, I think we can divide the everything with the 4 table right divide by the 4 we will get an a minus 3x minus 1y plus 5 is equal to 0 
or else in the minus also we can change that so 3x plus y minus 5 is equal to 0 enter sign we can change and this is the required relationship relation between the x and y just we can stop here since they didn't say to find an x or y value and there is no enough data to find just they ask a relationship so relationship between x and y will be a linear equations Thank you.